Okay, so over a year ago I got this Reckless journal and you can actually find the tour of it on my YouTube channel if you want to see it. The link will be at the top of the description box. Let's just have a recap as to how much fun I had with it. So we've got two options, I either throw it down the stairs or out the window into the garden. Hmm. I'm going to throw it out the window. I'm up high. <laughs> Goodbye, book. In fact, wait, let me zoom out so we can actually see it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so frightened. <laughs> And because I had so much fun, I decided to go to Amazon and pick myself up the Wreck This Journal Everywhere. Hopefully that will show up. So let's go and get it. And here it is. Let's go! Wow, that's significantly smaller than the other size. Didn't know that. I wonder if it'll get as thick. Hmm. So here is the smaller book, which is Wreck the Journal Everywhere by Kerry Smith and like little lists and stuff. So I've just I've just literally bent the spine already. Um, so let's see if there's anything different in this book. It looks like it's like a travel version so you can take it with you. Not seen that page before. So what I was going to do is maybe do like a series on this channel. Um, if you would like to see a series of this Reckless Journal everywhere, then leave a comment below and yeah, I will make a series on it. I think I will actually do a page today and if you did enjoy it, then yeah, leave a thumbs up. So I found a few pages that say um, choose your own wrecking method. Now, I've decided, let's grab the scroller box from this month, which is this kit here with the magic colours and the pens. I'm not going to use the brush because I've got loads of brushes that I'm going to use. I thought, let's try and do what we did with this piece. If you've not seen that video, um, it's the couple videos ago, the Scrawler Box unboxing. So yeah, I'm going to have a go at that. So what I need to do is fold this paper and put it underneath because I feel like the inks are going to go through. So actually tape the back of it so it stays down see if that'll work and I'll do the same with the other side because I'm going to fill the whole page so I'm going to need to spritz it with water oh I forgot to ask let me know in the comments below if you have used this book or if you have got it I'd love to know <laughs> Right, let's get another piece of this washi tape and stick it down. Okay, I think we're almost ready to start wrecking this page. <laughs> right, we're ready to go. The pages are pretty thin, so I wouldn't be surprised if it bleeds through. See, look. Yeah. 
but not to worry. I am not worried at all. I'm literally just gonna go for it. Probably. And we'll see what happens. Hopefully the paper underneath has like saved it. <laughs> And if not, that's fine. I don't mind. Let's put some white white dots around. Oh, maybe this is too much water. Right. I can already see that it's going through, but let's just push it around a bit. I bet it's sunk through onto so many pages by going through the middle. But I don't mind that at all because I quite like this where it's going so far. Get some of that lighter yellow. Probably put some down here. Mind you, it is called a reckless journal, so you are supposed to wreck it, aren't you? So. <laughs> Well. I kind of like how this is turning out. Might have to get the hairdryer to dry it quickly because I am very impatient sometimes. Just made a mess on my desk, but that's fine. And then we'll go over it with some like um, pens. Not sure what we're gonna do yet, but we'll see, we'll see. Well, I'm pretty happy with this so far. I kinda want more yellow in that space. I'll try and leave as much as this in real time as well, just so make it a bit longer. Right, now I think that's alright, so I am going to let it dry and I will come back. I am back and it is all dried and I sketched out some flower designs with my pencil. Now I'm going to go in with the graphics um, pens that we got from the box as well. I'm going to ink it, hopefully it'll ink. I think I'm going to use the 0.4 and see if that works. <laughs> if not, I will use 0.8 and make it bigger. So I think what we'll do is we will just go straight in and ink the things. So yeah, this is a great way to use the scroller box supplies as well. If you, I think, <laughs> I think things with the Reckless Journal, it's really good to have like a variety of different tools. So you could use paint, acrylic, gouache, inks like these, pencils, stamps, you could even make a lino print stamp and just stamp it in here, maybe clay, fabrics, all sorts of different things. Now the middle of this is actually black but I am not going to make it black, I am going to keep it to the colours that it is because yeah, why not? Spent all that time filling it in, there's no point changing it, I guess. So I might just do a round circle, just like that, and have it white. 
Now I only put this on really thinly because if I did put it on like thick it would pick up the paint and probably stop the pen working which is what we don't want. <laughs> But yes, it is already August, which means we're two months away from the best month, and you know what that is. Inktober, is anyone taking part this year? Because I most certainly am. It was a good prompt list last year, so hopefully it'll be another good one this year. Right, let's do these as well. And then it's got one line down the middle and some of it is like textured. I love these books. I'm going to try, if I can, complete this in a shorter amount of time is what I did to the Big Reckless Journal. So then I can buy a different one and try that. I want to try them all. I know Mariah Elizabeth has the Create This Book as well, and I'd love to uh, try that book. But I think my favourite so far was definitely the, the bigger Wreck This Journal that I did. But you never know, this tiny one might um, take over, because I can take it anywhere. So we might have to go on a trip. I can't really, I'm not allowed to drive at the moment because uh, we're still trying to figure out what's going on with my brain, whether I've got epilepsy or not, so <laughs> we've got to wait a bit longer before we can go on a trip. It could be a year or so, but I suppose you could take the train or bus. Well, I mean, I could. <laughs> not you guys, I mean myself. I think I'm gonna go I didn't get that. Could you try again? I didn't even ask you anything. <laughs> silly watch. Silly, silly watch. Have I been doing this on autofocus the whole time? Oh no, I think I have. I'm sorry about this. I've changed it, so it should be all right now. So I bet it was focusing on my hand instead of the drawing. Has anyone else done that with their cameras before? <laughs> I think I'll ink this one and then I will fast forward the rest because I don't want this to be too long of a video. Unless you all like those kinds, then that's fine. There we go. I'll just quickly do this one. And then I will skip to the end. And we'll have a little chat. Even though we have been chatting this whole time. Sometimes it's easy to do chatty videos and then sometimes it's not. I think it all depends what kind of mood you're in. And today I'm feeling pretty good. So yes, here we go. Am I using the right pen? I think I am. We're gonna shade some of this just so we can like see the difference. I love these types of flowers. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do for Ink Toby yet because I know I did like I've done like tattoo style for the past two times I think. I did want to do a story but I think that takes a lot of brain power. <laughs> right, so I will just shade this bit in. And then I will come back once it's finished. I'm, I'm using 0.2 for this section if you wondered. Okay. Right, all that's left to do now is sign and date it. So I will sign it. And the date today is the 3rd of August 22. There we go. So yeah, that's it for the first page that I did in this book. I will do be doing random pages so I won't be doing it in order. <laughs> so yeah, if you did enjoy this video, 
please leave a like, comment below if you want the series and share with your friends, subscribe for more, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time with another video. Okay, bye bye!